Hi folks, how you doing? Listen, I tried to do a live show and the camera froze up, so I'm doing it uh, this way. The events of this morning are going to have broad-based ramifications. I'm talking about specifically what has happened with North Korea this morning. This is the Wall Street Journal. North Korea claims to test a hydrogen bomb. Well, it wasn't a claim. It actually, in fact, was a hydrogen bomb. Folks, the problem here is this. This was not supposed to be in the range of where North Korea was supposed to be in their nuclear development. When you start getting to hydrogen bombs, you have definitely entered into the big boy uh, group. This is a club that nobody wants North Korea to be having, but it is very apparent they do have it and have it they will most likely begin to threaten the world with. This is a game changer. This is changing the course and direction of our world. And this is not high privily. This is serious. And I can assure you, the Western powers will be making a statement. It is very obvious that diplomatic channels have not worked. The world now stands on the precipice as to how it will begin to respond. I lived through the Cuban Missile Crisis. I was in first and second grade, and distinctly still can remember the duck and cover exercises that we did regularly. I would say that this is above that. This is very serious. I take it serious. If there is ever the opportunities to start getting our collective consciousness together and focus in on harmony, de-escalation, it is now. Otherwise, we are on the path to a war. And a war it will be. I can't get any more serious about this. This is not playtime. This is not make-believe time. This is not denial time. This is time to begin to get real, and this is as real as it gets. The world has not been on the brink of war as it is at this moment in time, and it is on the brink. The United States has a president unlike the last one, who will not mollify, cuddle, or pacify this madman. I can assure you that this president and this administration have been preparing for such an event. And we're not gonna like it, folks. We may have no choice but to do a preemptive strike. We may have no choice to make the difficult decisions. Our thoughts need to be with President Trump and his entire cabinet. We need to be thinking about Secretary of State Tillerson. I am sure that they are in crisis meeting as I speak. My thoughts and my prayers is that humanity does not take this step. Because we'll need a God. If they start, which I don't see any way out of this, 
with the megatonnage of this hydrogen bomb. Again, this was not supposed to be within North Korea's realm. Now, if they've done this, I can assure you he can put one on a candlestick. My God, people, now more than ever, humanity must seek another way because this way is not the way. Be kind to one another.